Good afternoon. Homicides in the metro are down so far this year by 22% and the Albuquerque Police Department is hoping to keep it that way. News 13's Madison Connor spoke to the police chief today. She joins us live from APD Maine downtown. Medina says there are multiple factors leading to the decrease in homicides, but he says the main contributor are more criminals staying behind bars. So far in 2023, homicides here in Albuquerque are down 22%. You know, I think there's a lot of things that uh, we can attribute to that. I think it's a combination of various activities that the police department has conducted, but also changes in other parts of the criminal justice system. Last year around this time, Albuquerque saw 105 homicides compared to the 82 so far this year. We've arrested uh, 44 people from homicides related to this year, 22 from last year. And over the past two years, uh, we've taken into custody 217 individuals and charged them with homicide. Well, Chief Medina believes the low numbers could be attributed to multiple reasons. One sticks out. The vast majority of those have remained behind bars, and that's 217 criminals because they were involved in other activities generally prior to their homicides that are no longer in the streets. Most months have seen half of the number of homicides from the previous year. But the month that we struggled the most with was with April. Uh, we we're doing really well going into April and we got a little concerned during April because of the fact that we had 12 compared to six the year before. APD is hoping to stay on track and not let the holiday months take a turn for the worse. We are getting better at knowing that there are certain times of year when things are going to kick up. Prepping as a department for Halloween. They will have resources out Halloween weekend, that they will be out to break up those parties earlier and that we will be doing everything we can to ensure that uh, we reduce the possibility of shootings. Hoping to move the city in the right direction. I think just the number of people we've arrested, uh, the fact that there are consequences and criminals know it is starting to have an impact. Now we should point out that larger issues may also be at work. Murders are down 9% this year across 30 major cities, including Denver, Los Angeles, and New York. Now that's according to the Nonpartisan Council on Criminal Justice. Back to you. All right, thank you, Madison. The Albuquerque Police Department says it's also going to focus on shoplifting as we head into November and December.